Magic Hour by Kristen Hanna is a heartwarming novel about love, redemption, and discovering where one truly belongs. The story is set in the small town of Rain Valley, nestled in the Pacific Northwest, where Dr. Julia Cates, a renowned child psychiatrist, finds herself grappling with the fallout of a public scandal that has tarnished her professional reputation. When her sister, Ellie Barton, now the chief of police in their hometown, calls her to help with an extraordinary case, Julia sees a chance for personal and professional redemption. In the depths of the Olympic rainforest, a wild and feral six-year-old girl appears from seemingly nowhere. Puzzled by the child's sudden emergence and behavior, Ellie entrusts her to Julia's care. The girl is quickly dubbed Alice by the media, reflecting her mysterious arrival akin to the protagonist from Alice in Wonderland. Deeply traumatized and unable to communicate with words, Alice proves to be a challenge unlike any Julia has faced before. As Julia works tirelessly to break through the child's barriers and uncover the truth of her background, townspeople speculate wildly about Alice's origins. Suggestions range from child abduction to living among wolves. Julia's approach to treating Alice is a mixture of patience, scientific curiosity, and growing emotional attachment. She begins to employ innovative and unorthodox techniques to gain the child's trust and affection, employing the help of a local veterinarian named Max to address the physical issues that Alice faces due to her prolonged isolation in the wild. The arrival of Alice acts as a catalyst for changes throughout Rain Valley, as media attention and the curiosity of outsiders disrupt the town's usually peaceful existence. Meanwhile, Julia navigates her own personal trials, interacting with her sister Ellie, with whom she shares a strained relationship fraught with the pains of a difficult childhood and diverging paths in life. As Julia and Ellie work together for Alice's sake, they begin to reconcile their differences, finding strength and understanding in their shared goal and their love for Alice. Investigations into Alice's past bring to light a chilling backstory of abduction and survival. It is revealed that the girl lived with a recluse in the woods after being taken from her family at a young age. The man, whom Alice referred to as Daddy, has died, leaving her entirely alone and forcing her venture into civilization. As Julia and Alice's bond deepens, Julia faces the harsh reality that she cannot keep Alice forever. Child Protective Services, coupled with the media frenzy, puts pressure on the situation, as does the eventual discovery of Alice's biological father. Ian, a grieving man whose daughter was kidnapped and thought dead, is desperate to rebuild a lost connection with the child he never stopped searching for. Alice's progress is a marvel to the community and showcases Julia's exceptional abilities as a therapist. Julia's methods, which some colleagues had deemed too empathetic and personal, are validated as Alice begins speaking and showing signs of adapting to her new life. However, the small gains are threatened when Alice's biological father starts a legal battle for custody. Torn between her professional duty and the love she feels for Alice, Julia is faced with the potential of losing the child she has come to see as her own. During a climactic custody hearing, the court must decide if Alice will stay with Julia, who has become her psychological anchor, or be handed back to her biological father, who has been a stranger to her for most of her life. The emotional toll of the hearing reveals the strengths and limitations of the legal system when it comes to the best interests of a deeply traumatized child. In the end, Julia understands that what Alice needs most is the chance to reconnect with her past and build a future with her father. She makes the heart-wrenching decision to support their reunion. Through this difficult process, Julia realizes the profound impact she has made on Alice's life and the profound impact Alice has made on hers. Magic Hour concludes with a bittersweet resolution. Julie has been transformed by her experience with Alice, finding new meaning in both her personal life and professional endeavors. She's also reconciled with Ellie, and their bond as sisters is stronger than ever. Alice begins a new life with her father, carrying with her the love and stability Julia provided during a critical moment of her development. Kristen Hanna weaves through these events a narrative that explores the human capacity for change and the enduring power of love. Magic Hour is a tale of resilience, the complexities of the human psyche, 
and the magical moments that can emerge from life's darkest corners. Through Julia, Alice, and the cast of characters in Rain Valley, Hannah illuminates the strength found in community, the significance of healing, and the importance of forging connections, no matter how improbable they may seem. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.